is not a birthright. It's earned with teeth and claws and sacrifice. Savagery wins wars. If you're strong enough to seize it, this new kingdom will be yours. For generations, kings and queens have reigned well over Mombo. A bountiful Eden far south of Savuti. face the greatest threat to their long rule. A rebel army is rising from the shadows. Led by Mamutsi, commander of the dam. The abundant land fuels her savage ranks. She now has enough soldiers to lay siege to the kingdom. Hiding in the darkness, eating scraps. Mamutsi wants the lion's share. She wants it all. She wants the throne. had nothing to fear until now. <laughs> the tide is turning. Queens do not surrender lightly. Perhaps a truce? Only a fool could believe such nonsense. to reveal the full force of her hidden army. Mamut 
Lucy sets her unstoppable virus loose on Eden. Her new regime feeds on fear and violence. Under Mamutsi's wretched reign, life in the kingdom is about to change for everyone. Pula rules the forest. The beating heart of the realm. Her torn ear just one of a decade's worth of scars. From battles fought and battles won. Not born into royalty, Pula works hard for her dominion. But her success is marred by tragedy. She has only one surviving heir. This season could be her final chance to further her legacy. She will be strong and ready. The advantage of high position in paradise. There's always a seat at the high table. this humble born her wealth. A firm grip ensures she keeps it. Hide your riches and eat fast. Thieves are everywhere. Every bite makes Pula stronger. But the truly wise know when to yield.
There's plenty more where that came from. But dark times are coming. Shattered monarchs drift in fragments of their former prides. But three stubborn warriors remain in the promised land. Led by Seha, with only half a tail. The sisters of the Matata pride are stranded. Their family is scattered. But their will is far from broken. must rebuild her pride from the ground up. One little piggy at a time. She has her own hidden secret. Six young heirs. Future kings and queens. The foundations of a new empire. Her sisters share the burden. And the babysitting. A relentless onslaught of tiny teeth. Hunger bodes well for the pride's fortunes. If Seha can keep them alive and teach them some manners, This ravenous horde will one day rule the kingdom. The balance of power can shift in an instant. But there's always one who swaggers with ease through the wreckage. Blue Eyes, the most charming leopard in the realm. He's making his rounds, staking his claims. Quite the perfect specimen.
He didn't really feel like Warthog anyway. Blue Eyes is not here for food. He's here for Pula. She only has eyes for him. Vanity aside, he is proud and strong. and Pula's best chance to further her bloodline. Side, her legacy could last for generations to come. The young are the future. Say <coughs> how pride grows stronger every day. <coughs> These cubs will be warriors. But for now, they depend on their mothers for everything. Protect them at all costs. Inside their crash, the world is safe. But there's always one born bolder than the rest. Adventure lures the curious cub away from his mother's cautious eye. He's yet to learn the dangers of the wild. An innocent spirit in a ruthless world. Mother's intuition is seldom wrong. A head count confirms.
one cub is missing. Seha issues a call to arms. Where is he? Search as they may, their efforts are in vain. has seen to that. A mother's grief means nothing to him. It's just an easy meal and one less future rival. Say ha has not only lost a valuable soldier, but a son. a wicked world. But here in Mombo, it does reset the game. In this kingdom, water is the real power. The new season delivers all Pula ever wanted. This is Motsidi. Welcome to the world, my little one. Pula's destiny now rests on your tiny shoulders. is not to be trusted. He's killed his own cubs before. Pula cannot risk his dark side again. his own.
Pula has got what she needed from Blue Eyes. Now she must protect her investment. Leave us alone. You are no longer welcome. Matsidi is all that matters now. Keep her safe, Pula. Carry her gently from her violent father. from everyone until she can hold her own. Mamutse's reign begins with chaos. Her minions patrol every corner of the kingdom. The orders are simple. No one is above her rule. Everyone will pay a price. Most would cower in the presence of this dragon. But Mamutse sees only opportunity. Even dragons will serve the tyrant. this tug of war to get ahead. There is always more to steal until she conquers everyone.
the Matata pride's loss hardens their resolve. The sisters nurture their surviving cubs. One day they will take on tyrants together. But until then, they will trust no one. Drifting vagabond, out of place in the new regime. Seha does not know him, nor his intentions. He could offer protection, perhaps even a quick path to the throne. But at what price? He could kill all their remaining cubs. The sisters can't risk losing another. The decision is clear. But the wounded hopeful still begs for acceptance. He needs them more than they need him. But Seha cannot take the chance. Their new dynasty is far too important. These warrior sisters will build their empire on their own. Matsidi does not have the benefit of the Queen's guard. But she does have a devoted role model. Pula is her protector. provider. She will teach her everything she needs to know. Motsidi already shares her mother's spirit. Curious and bold, 
A young assassin, eager to explore her forest world. She has so much to learn. Savor these precious moments, Pula. Danger is only ever a footfall away. A single hyena is a very bad omen. Where there's one, there are always more. Pula knows the kingdom's tyrants. But this is Mutsidi's first encounter. They will be here soon. Quick! Hide! Your tyrant queen may think herself a royal. Spy. We still own the forest. Where are you, little one? Did I teach you well? Pula is wise and strong, a self-made noble who earns her power. If Motsidi follows her mother's footsteps, one day she will inherit this world. But the walls are closing in. Floodwaters surround the kingdom. Now just an island 
in Botswana's Great Delta. a new cat. This is no place for a cheetah. Not now. promise of plenty to feed her three cubs. <laughs> this place certainly seems like heaven to this family. Little does she know. Mamutsi's rotten clan sees everything. <laughs> this land is no Eden. for anyone but them. The hostile welcome exposes her horrible mistake. This young mother has led her family into hell. Now they're trapped on an island ruled by tyrants. But if she navigates this nightmare, she could stake her own claim to the savage kingdom.